Hello, guys. Welcome. Hi, Miss. Welcome, guys. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good. I'm happy to hear that. Um, good to see everybody. All right, let's uh, work. Hello. Let me say hi. Hi, Josue. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, I'm glad to hear that. Uh, Andres, how are you? Fine, Tisha, how are you? Good, good. How was your day today? Everything okay. Good, good, okay, all right, excellent. Hi, Elsie, how are you? Hi, teacher, I'm fine, and you? Good, I'm glad to hear that. Um, how, how was your day today? Uh, it's very tired. Yeah, why? What happened? Um, I don't, no escuché, perdón. Oh, I was asking you what happened. Why, why was it very tiring? Eh, mucho trabajo. <laughs> Oh, okay. Too much work. Okay, I understand. Yeah, that happens. Okay. All right. Um, hello, Suleyma. Hello, teacher. How are you? I remember it was Yvonne, right? You prefer Yvonne? Yes, I prefer Yvonne. But it's okay. No worry. All right. No problem. No, no. I just, uh, I'm getting used to it. I will, I will remember um, who, how to call you from late, later on. Okay. I'm just getting okay. used to, okay. All right. How, so how was your day? Uh, uh, very busy, but everything is okay. I think. Good. Okay. All right. Busy, but okay. All right. That's good. All right. Let me say hi to Manuel. How are you, Manuel? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hi, fine. I'm things. Good. I'm glad to hear that. How was your day today? How was your day, Manuel? Uh, Manuel Montoya or, or oh, Manuel? Oh, sorry. Ma Manuel, let me see. Yeah, Manuel Rodriguez. <laughs> okay. Good evening, teacher. Uh, nice. Uh, uh, one day, uh, very, very, very he heavy, and so tired, uh, or, or blessing. And uh, I'm ready to the to the class. Good. I'm glad to hear that. That's the 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 attitude, right? Very good. Excellent. Okay, Fabiola, how are you, Fabiola? <clears throat> Sorry, I can't hear you, Fabiola. Can you speak a little louder? Yeah. I, I can't hear you. Can you speak a little bit louder? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Marvin. Welcome. Thanks. Fabiola, can you hear me? I see. Hola. Okay, how are you? Also, teacher. It was very heavy. Okay, good. I'm glad to hear that. All right, um, Juan, how are you, Juan? Juan? Francisco. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening, Juan. How are you? Hi, uh, I, I am bo I am busy. You're busy, really? Busy. Why? Yes. Tell me. <laughs> what, what, why are you so busy? Uh, um, my daughter's uh, had very, very hunger. <laughs> Oh, 
Your 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 daughter has a lot of homework. Oh, look at good, that! Good. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. so nice to see her. Yeah. <laughs> How old is your daughter? What? How old is your daughter? Ah, uh, um, and seven and uh, six year old. Seven years old. Oh, she's so cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, very nice. Very nice. Oh, well, that's good. That's good. And it's good that you're um, learning English, uh, one, because that way you will help her later um, when she learns English. Mm -hmm. Good. Excellent. Hello, Jennifer. Let me say hi to Jennifer. How are you, Jennifer Magali? Hi, I'm fine. Good. It's good to see you, Jennifer. Uh, we missed you yesterday. It's good. <laughs> so yeah, well, I'm happy to meet you. Thanks. Wow, and um, you you um you're out in a beautiful place right now. A lake? A lake. Oh wow, look at that. Nice, nice. I like it. Well, no wonder, no wonder you were you were not here. You are out on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> A little. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's good. Excellent. All right. Let me say hi to Edgar. Hi, teacher. How are you, Edgar? Fine, fine. Thank you, teacher. I'm glad to hear that. How was your day? Um it uh very 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 hard um um i'm i'm work um i work um more more activities um all all day um the responsibility uh supervise uh um the the people is uh it's very very hard oh you are a supervisor edgar yeah teacher oh i see yeah i understand lots yeah. lots of responsibilities okay good all yeah. right um all right well the good thing is that um there's a job right and um uh, and uh maybe like when you learn more english you will be able to uh maybe i don't know it have less responsibilities and still earn a lot of money. <laughs> so hopefully, right? That will uh, hopefully that will happen for you. Okay. Hello, Marvin. How are you? Very good, teacher. Good. I'm happy to hear that. You're. Uh, how are you doing today? Uh, um, work. You you have work to do. You're very busy at work? You're, you're very busy at work? Can you hear me or no? Can you hear me? No? Okay. I think maybe we're having trouble communicating. Um, okay. Um, all right, let me say, Julio Cesar, how are you? Oh, Julio Cesar is with us. Hello, okay. hello, how are you doing? Hello, how are you? I'm doing good, I'm just getting ready. Okay, okay, no problem. You take your time. Thank you. I'm okay, here. how, how was your day today? Uh, well, I was, I was sleeping most of, most of the day. Because I had uh, I had I had to take a ship a late night ship, so I was sleeping uh, most of the day. Okay, I see. All right. Well, the good thing is that you're with us. Good. Okay. Did I say hi? Oh no, I haven't said hi to everybody. Hello, Warner. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Um, are you are, are you right now on the on the uh, the um, computer? 
just compare my cell phone is um let's see is car uh, charger what, what's the problem with the cell phone Estoy cargando el celular. oh it's charging okay all right um as soon as you can please if you can turn on the camera because remember you need to turn on the camera and in fact i just wanted to ask that um with for everybody um so if you guys can help me with that, I would really appreciate if you can turn on the cameras, um, since it is the requirement from Insaforp that we have the cameras on, we need to turn them on, okay? All right, so um, let's see, let me take attendance before anything. Um, okay, let me see. Okay, so we have Josué. Josue Salas is here. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. And Andres Giovanni. Present teacher. Good. And uh, Elsie Janet. Present teacher. <clears throat> Okay, wonderful. And uh, Manuel Alejandro. I'm here, teacher. And we have Fabiola Georgina. Yes, thank you, sir. Okay. And Juan Francisco. Present teacher. All right, wonderful. And um, let me see, we have Edgar, Edgar Alfredo. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. <laughs> and Marvin Wilfredo. Present teacher. Okay. Francisco Javier. Present. Okay. And we have um, Julio Cesar. Right here, teacher. All right, excellent. Uh, Alejandra. Here, teacher. Okay, wonderful. Um, Jennifer Magali. Present. Okay, good, thank you. Edgar Alfredo. Present teacher. Edgar, uh, could you do me a favor? Hold on, just give me a moment. Ah, okay, never mind, never mind, we're fine, okay. All right, um, Manuel Montoya. Present. Okay, thank you. Manuel, could you do me a favor? Could you help me out with uh, putting on the camera, please, if you could do that for me? Okay, thank you. And uh, let's see, we have... Um, all right, we have get it, get it, who else? Uh, Werner. Werner's here. Present teacher. All right. Yes. Great. I am charging the phone, teacher. You want about 20 minutes. Oh, okay, hour. okay. As soon as you can turn on um, the 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 cell the cell phone so we can you can um, use it uh, for the Zoom. Okay. Yes. Yes, teacher. All right. And uh, Carla, we have Carla Cano, right? Okay, wonderful. All right, excellent, guys. Um, present. Great, excellent. Um, Carla, would you do me a favor of um, maybe turning on the camera so we can see you? Thank you, wonderful. Hello, Carla. Okay, and um, let's see. Um, 
Perfect. Okay. All right. So I have everybody here. Oh, guys, don't don't forget um, to write your name. Uh, like just like um, we talked about before, just like um, it's on your Dewey, the way that Insafarp would have it. Okay, guys. So anyway, um, today what we're going to be doing, uh, we're going to be, um, uh, we're going to first of all review a little bit about what we saw last class. Okay. And we're also going to be talking about, uh, we're gonna be learning a little bit about how to talk about abilities and how to um, talk about it, or better said, um, ask politely for things, okay? So what we're doing right now, I'm gonna share uh, right now with you the, hold on, just give me a moment, mate. Let me know when you can see the PowerPoint. If you can see it, let me know. Can you see it? Not yet, teacher. Not yet. No. Not yet. Uh, yes. Not yet? Okay. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Now yeah. you can uh, see it? Yes, yes teacher. Yes, teacher. Oh, okay, perfect. Okay. All right. Just, um, a second, see if I can make a little. Just give me a second. Okay. All right, guys. Um, so uh, we're going to. So today uh, we are in beginner four, right? It's day number seven. Okay. And uh, today is Tuesday, March 9, 2021. Now, I asked you guys um, the first thing I asked you to do, uh, remember, was the homework. Okay. I asked you to um, complete these exercises three and four, uh, three and five, uh, three that was on page 19 and five that is on page uh, 21, no, sorry, 20. Um, and what I'm gonna ask you to do right now, um, I, I hope everybody um, was able to, to come and complete the exercises. Yes, did everybody do that? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Okay, all right, so what I'm gonna ask you to do right now I want you to compare the answers to these two exercises with your partner, okay? So I'm going to get you, I'm going to, hold on. So remember page, this is from page 19 and this one's from page 20, okay? So I'm going to right now, um, stop sharing and I'm gonna get you guys to work in breakout rooms and you're gonna be comparing your answers with a partner. That's just going to take you very long. So I'm going to give you about, um, I'm going to give you, let me see, um, five minutes. I, I think you should even, you should have even been done um, less than, than, than uh, five minutes, but I'll give you five minutes just so that if you have a discussion, we can talk about that. Okay, so right now I'm going to open the rooms for everybody. Are you ready? Here we go. En la número tres, ¿verdad? Uh, it's necessary to follow those steps to push us the what someone needs. Yo, those le puse a usted. 
Hola. Do you have any problems with the homework? No, la estamos comparando. Okay, you're comparing. Okay, no problem. Um, but did you have problems when you were doing the homework? Como ayer la señal no era muy buena y casi no se escuchaba bien. Habían cosas que quedaron sin. ¿Quieres que tenga una duda en la página 20, en la de la tarea, verdad? No, 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 también no, no, no. Sí. Have any questions, Alejandra? No, para el momento no, solo que la tarea era la número tres y la cinco, ¿verdad? Exercise three and five, yeah. So, Alejandra, if you want, you can, you can try to practice a little bit more English, okay? So that way you will get, uh, you will get better at it, okay? So you can ask me in English, no problem. And if you have any questions, I can help you. Okay. And number one, the exercise three, and it's necessary to follow those steps to push out what someone needs. Is those or that? In number oh. one, you say? Yes. Um, number one from which exercise? exercise? Three. three. From number three, ah, okay. Uh, All right, so it's necessary to follow. Okay, no, now, now notice the word steps. Steps is a word that is plural, right? Okay, uh -huh. because steps with an S, right? So it's plural. So because it's a, it's plural, which one do you use with plural? Those or that? Those. Exactly. So that would have to be the answer, those. Okay. okay? It's right. The, the answer is right. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. Okay. Do you have any other uh, questions? No. Uh, no, no. I think I know the answer for the next one. For for me, no more questions. Okay, I'm gonna go and visit another group. See you, girls, later. Okay. Bye. Um, Fabio. You bring this. Okay. Yes. Okay. Hi, teacher. Hi, guys. How are you doing with the with the exercise? I can. Okay. Um. Well, I think that um, we are doing the correct uh, writing out about the. Uh, Um, sobre las, las partes que están faltando ¿no? sobre los, 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 los demostrativos los nombres demostrativos es correcto sí o no yeah yeah we're, we're, we're checking the answers to the demonstrative yes correct okay okay do you have any questions no 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 thank you no yeah, you're welcome okay. Continue, okay, pretend that I'm not here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you cannot add um, those, uh, sería en those or those. sweaters to the chart. Those four six in the five. And the five, uh, your four sister of, of the chart. It's four. Sweaters to the chart. This is. Um, I think Hi, teacher. Hi, guys. Uh, it's teacher. One, uh, one question. Uh, the, uh, la tarea era la que íbamos a hacer, ¿no? Íbamos a revisar. Yeah, correct. You're, you're checking uh, the homework. They check the homework. Ah, uh -huh. just, okay. Yes. Yeah. See. Uh, okay. See. So what are, um, what ha is your your cell phone is still charging, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Uh, unos, okay. Uh, cuando regresemos, uh, en come back. ¿Cómo se dice? Come back. Come back. And, uh, yeah. Sí, and come back. Uh, um, and connected the welcome. Okay. Okay. Thank you. 
okay, no problem. Okay. okay. Uh, Carla, uh, are, is your is your camera working? To, yeah, is the the camera is uh, ready, teacher itself. No, no, I'm asking Carla. Is is Carla? Ah, Carla. Uh, uh, Carla is here, teacher, but. Uh, um, Hello, teacher. I'm here. Hi, Carla. <laughs> I work. I'm really sorry. It's okay. Um, yeah, just I was wondering um, what happened to you. Is your camera working? My camera. Yeah, your camera. Is it working? Yeah, of course. I'm here. Okay, good, excellent. Are you guys finished comparing? Yeah, uh, yes, teacher, uh, they finished the... Uh, okay. The... You're, you're finished comparing. Okay, no problem. I'll... We'll go, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna, I'll see you in the main room, okay? Okay, uh, one question, uh, teacher. Um, yeah? Is... Eh, ¿Cómo se dice? No sé si estarán buenas, teacher. Eh, tengo... You're not sure it's okay. Ajá, eh, de check the, the fake. Uh, I, I don't know the, this uh, number six. I have to go to buy, I don't, I don't know, those new bots. Books. Okay, we're going to be checking. Okay, we're going to be Porque tengo que los, okay. Sorry, Warner. No, eh, este es, cor, es correcto, no, teacher. Hola. Gracias. For new book. Uh, I, I have to I go buy... to buy those new books at the library. Yeah, very good, because the library is far away from you. Yes, it's correct. Uh, okay. It's plural, yeah. Sí, es, yeah. it's difficult. Uh, 114 eh, tienen efectivo, ¿verdad? In, in, eh, es difícil para uh, conversación con um, the, the, um, the object, uh, o oh, I don't know, the, oh, el problema, teacher, perdón, cuando el objeto lo tenemos cerca o cuando lo tenemos cer lejos, es, digamos, en el momento que se está hablando, es, se vuelve una dificultad saber si lo tenemos cerca o lo tenemos lejos. Por ejemplo, esta es la número tres que decía My friend and I are interested on that may up. O sea, no entendía si tenía la tablet cerca o lejos, pero entiendo que está en una vitrina y la está viendo cerca. I, I um, yes, it's my friend and I are interested on that... No, I, sorry, teacher. No, number three is uh, on the tablet, tablet, tablet. The uh, first one, is... number one. Ah, uh, number one. Sorry, teacher. Uh -huh, number Do you one. want to buy it, this tablet? Uh, yes, I want to buy the black one. O sea, quiero una negro set. Pero no sé si la tiene cerca o la tiene lejos. Entendería yeah, yo que la says, tiene cerca. It says that the black one it probably means that there are many that are on display. They are on this, uh -huh, okay. Okay, so if they're on display, probably you're not very close to it. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, does that make sense? Uh, yes, uh, and the number uh -huh. two is, is, is uh, I, I, I think, uh, I see, because I see these jeans, so, so I see it is, uh, it's, it's far. Okay, um, can I see? Okay, probably, um, probably oh. you're, you're, you're pointed to the genes. So if you're pointing to the genes, they're close to you. Now, remember genes is plural because it's genes with an the S, genes. right? So it's sing not singular, yes. but plural. And not singular, it's, uh, mm -hmm. it's plural. Yes, correct. Uh, okay. Okay, it's, so don't forget that. This. Okay. All right, I'll see you in the main session, guys. All right? Okay, teacher. Thank you. You're welcome.
Okay, wonderful. So I have the majority of you here. Okay, great. So what we're going to do, um, I'm going to be showing you the, I'm going to show you right now the, the exercise. And what I need you guys to do is to give me your answers. Okay. Um, so let me project right now. Here we go. All right, can everybody see this? No, I guess. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Yeah. Everybody can see yes. it? Okay, good. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna choose randomly and I'd like you guys to give me the answer, okay? So I'm gonna choose different people randomly to give me the answers. Okay, so I'm going to start with and let's start with Edgar. Edgar, yeah. can you give me the answer for number one? Um, it's a uh, DOS teacher. DOS is necessary to follow DOS step to purchase what someone needs. Okay, uh, good, very good. All right, excellent. So the answer is those. Actually, just give me a moment. I'm going to change the. Specific. Okay. There we go. Okay. So it's necessary to follow those steps to purchase that what someone needs. Why do we use the words those? It's because steps, if you notice the word steps. Yes. Um, steps. Okay. So if you notice the word steps, the word steps is plural, right? Okay, steps yeah. is an S. And because it has an S, that means that what we have to use is a, a demonstrative pronoun that is plural. And the only one that's plural between these two is those, right? Okay, okay. does that make sense? Yeah, is that okay for everybody or any questions? It's okay. Okay, good. All right, let's uh, let's go on to the next one then. Um, let me have, uh, let's see, Alejandra. Alejandra, do you want to answer number two for me? Uh, that. Okay, could you get, get rid of the whole sentence for me? I think that I want to buy that because I like it. Okay, good, all right. Why do you say that, Alejandra? Could you explain that to me? It's a singular word. It says is one, and that is in singular. Perfect, there you go, all right. Because we're talking about the desk, and the desk is singular, right? So the only word that is singular there is the word um, that. So very good, excellent, Alejandra. Okay. Let's go now to, um, let's see, uh, we're going to go to um, Andres. And Andres, can you help me? Number three. For number three, yes. Uh, do you want to buy this refrigerator? It comes in four different colors. Good, okay. Excellent. This refrigerator, why did you choose this? Because it's just one refrigerator. Good. Exactly. Refrigerator is singular. It's only one. And the only one between these two that is singular is this. Now, be careful with the pronunciation. The, these two words, they look like they are pronounced the same, but they're not. Okay, these two words have a different uh, pronunciation. Uh, I want you to practice this with me. This one right here is pronounced these. Okay, everybody, these. These. Okay, everybody, come on. I want, I want to hear everybody, not just about two or three people. Let's try it. These. 
Yes. Yes. Wonderful. Okay, good. That's much better. All right. Now, this one right here, this word here, is pronounced this. 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 Good. This. 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 Mm -hmm. Exactly. Now, what is the difference if you notice with this one? This one is a longer sound. You say these, ease, right? So we, we make the sound longer, right? Whereas this one is shorter. You just say this, okay? So this is these, and you open up your mouth a little bit more. These is longer. And this one is this, okay? So don't confuse it when you are pronouncing, okay? Just uh, make sure that you, you are very, you're very clear on which one you're using. Okay, right, let's continue. Um, let me have a Warner. Warner, could you give me answer to number four, please? Just read uh, number four. I am going to buy this two tablet table. With okay, these. after there, after that, that's fine. That's fine. Um, Warner, after there, it's fine. All right, let's 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 look at this one first. Okay, so which one is it? This one, or, or better say, number one or number two? Uh, um, number number one. Uh, num is plural. First is, is plural. Very good. Yes. Okay. Yes, and second uh, is is uh, singular. Uh, this car, this credit card. Exactly. Very good. Okay. Okay. Excellent job, Werner. Excellent. Okay. Yes, you're absolutely right. And the right here, if you notice, we have tablets, which is plural. Okay. And so that means that it's going to be these. Okay. And then over here we have car, right? Which is singular. And so that's why it's going to be this. Sounds good. Any questions? No teacher. No? Okay. So this exercise is clear for everybody, right? Yeah? Okay. All right, let's move on to number five. Um, let's go to exercise five and I want, uh, let me see, let's have, uh, Marvin, Marvin, help! Can you help me with exercise number one? Read. Um. Yeah. Read and give me the answer if possible. Sorry. Okay. Uh, do you have to buy the tablet? Yes. I want to buy the black one. Okay. Very good. All right. So you say the word is that. Yes. Okay. And. You know what? I agree with you. Yes, very good. Now, why would it be the word that? The reason is basically because we, if you notice, it says here, I want to buy the black one. So notice that, um, notice that there are probably many, many different tablets that are on display, right? So if you're saying the black one means that there's more than than one, right? There's probably a black one, a white one, I don't know, a blue one, I don't know, whatever. And so obviously there are many uh, on display. Now, if it's on display, it's probably something that is not close to you, okay? Now, however, let's imagine that it is close to you. It is possible as long as you use the singular form, which would be this, right? Okay, that's, that could be the possible. All right, any questions so far? Yeah, but it's correct if I use this because I specified, the, how do you say specificando? Specify, yeah. Yeah, I, I spe specify yeah. uh, that I want the blood one. Of the, I think it's close. Yeah, like I said, it, it's possible. If you think it's, if, if, if for you, it's something that's close, this place close, sure. As long as I said, like I said, as long as it's singular, okay? Because tablet, the word tablet is singular, okay? So as long as you make sure of that, then we're fine, okay?
Okay, so it could be that or this, right? But make sure that it's definitely singular. All right. Yeah. Does that, right. Does that answer your question? It's clear. Yes, teacher. Teacher, yeah. eh, um, mm -hmm. si, no, si, no, si no logro entender completamente por qué se usa el, el, el that. O sea, entiendo que cuando dices quiere comprar esa tablet, ok, está cerca. Eh, y cuando responde, sí, quiero comprar la negra. Eh, eh, o sea, okay. se me da que sí hay una variedad de, de, de color similar a lo que es el refrigerador que viene en diferentes colores, pero, pero el dat para decir aquella. Um, okay, just make sure that you ask me in English, okay? Because the more you practice English, the better you will get at it, okay? Just remember that, okay? Um, like I said, it is possible, I'll repeat what I said, it is possible to use the word this if you consider that the display is close to you. However, you definitely have noticed that there is more than one tablet, right? Okay. Um, right, so because it says that I want to buy the black one. So it probably indicates that there is more than one tablet on display, right? So you probably can see the display and most of the time the displays are gonna be a little bit further away from you than further up, but it is possible. Okay, so, so as long okay, as but, it's uh, not, as long as it's uh, not plural. Okay, so you can use that or this. Both of them are fine. Okay. Yeah, sure. Sense? But uh, what about the plural of tablets? Oh, if it, if this was tablets, then it would be the um, those or these. Okay. So if 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 this said, okay, let me let me write this down. No, oh, no, okay, okay, okay. Um, the tablets are singular, okay, but and the um, answer is is for plural or for uh, what? Mm, I'm not sure if you, I understand your question. You want to ask the question again? Okay, um, the tablet is a, a singular, okay? And right. in this case, it's that or this. Right. That is correct. Mm -hmm. But what about the answer? I want to buy the black one. Uh -huh. Okay, it, this is for more than one tablet. Uh, okay, when it says here, I want to buy the black one, it's they're, they're saying is, from all the tablets that exist, all the, the different tablets, I want to buy this one. Notice that you're saying, you're not going to buy all the tablets, even though the tablets, there are many different tablets, but you're just gonna buy one tablet. You're not gonna buy three tablets, just one. That's why it's singular. Do you want to buy that, that particular tablet or this particular tablet? Does that make sense? Okay. You get to choose. Uh, in the exercise tree, uh -huh. in, the, in the item tree, do you want to buy this refrigerator? What about this? It comes in four different colors. Oh, in because- In the same item, in the same, uh, I don't know. Um, Miss, I, I think uh -huh. that it's correct to use this because it, the seller is offered to you uh, uh, is a tablet is close to, to him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, the customer asking for another uh, tablet. Uh, no, he's not asking for another tablet. He's seen the tablet. It's basically like when you say in Spanish, ¿Quiere comprar esa tablet? Sí. Pues, Quiero en mi caso, yo creería la que... La negra. No, el ven... sí, pero como vendedor, yo ofrezco un producto específico. O sea, estoy diciendo, tú quieres esta, y el comprador me dice, no, yo quiero la otra. Um, but it says here, but he doesn't say no. He says, yes, 
I want to buy okay. the black one. So he can, so that means that ah, he's, okay, he's okay, looking okay. at it yeah. and he's saying, yeah, yes, yeah, I, I got want it, that I got one. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got does it. that make sense? Yeah, yeah. Okay, whereas this one, okay, I understand where the confusion is coming from. In number three, in this one, the difference is that there's only one refrigerator that is being presented. And he's saying, it comes in four different colors. So if you choose what the, the seller is saying, if you choose that refrigerator, then you can choose four different colors. So we are only looking at one refrigerator. Whereas this one, we are looking at many different tablets because the, 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 the um, customer can choose which color. So that means that the customer can see the color. Does that make sense? But okay. like I said, it's, it, but definitely, so definitely it has to be singular. But if you want to use this, there's no problem. You can use this. Okay? Sounds good? Okay. All right. Any other questions? No? Not for me. Okay. All right. Let's go on to the next one. All right. But thank you guys for asking. Um, yeah, that's, that's wonderful. Go ahead and ask. No problem. Okay? Um, all right, um, let's see, Irene, can you help me off with number two? Over here, number two. Okay, okay. I can see these jeans, these jeans, sure, what size? All right, very good, very good, Irene. These jeans. Can you tell me why you chose these? Because a jeans is plural. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Um, yeah. yeah, exactly. Very good. You're absolutely right. Jeans, it's in English, jeans is plural. Even though um, even though it's like one item but it's composed of two parts. Each leg, it's like two parts, like one, two, right? Okay, so that's why jeans is plural, okay? okay. Now, uh, some of you may say, oh, maybe they are looking at the jeans far away. And sometimes like, have you noticed that, the, that they are on display like very high up and you can't touch it? Could be. So yes, it's fine. You can you you can use those as well as long as it's plural. So these or those, okay? Sounds good. Uh, right, because uh, in my case, I chose uh, those because okay. I I was thinking uh, looking at them far away from me, okay, not able sure. to touch them. Yeah, but, no but still, they were plural. Yes, as long as it's plural. Yeah, that's the most right. important part that it's plural. Okay. Yes. All right. Very good. Okay. Number three. Let me have. Uh, who else said? Help me with number three. Okay. <laughs> uh, I I chose. Uh, did you bring that package? Yes, I did. Number th number three. Who oh, it was number three. I'm yeah. sorry. It's okay. It was, uh, my friend and I are interested on this makeup. The small box. This makeup. Okay, the small box. Okay, right. good. All right. Uh, makeup. Makeup is singular. So yes, absolutely. This. Okay. Right. Yeah. Again, if you think that it's far, further away, sorry, if it's, you think it's close up to you, that's fine as long as it's um, singular. So you can use this or that. Yeah, so it's okay. Right. All right. All right, good, excellent. All right, let's move on to number four. We'll have Suleyma help us. Okay. Suleyma Yvonne. Did you bring that package? Yes, I did. Okay, very good. Did you bring that package? Okay. Now, this one probably this one probably makes sense only to use the word that. 
I wouldn't say that this can be used. And the reason is because if you say this, then you're pointing to it and you're saying this package. And if obviously if you're pointing to it, the person brought it, you know that the person brought it. Does that make sense? Right, yeah? right. Yes. Yeah. So right. Yeah, I, I wouldn't definitely not say that 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 this is a pro is a possibility. It would have to be that. Okay. That, Good. Right. Excellent. Okay, number five. Um, sure. Yeah. Okay. The and. Sorry. Okay. The, in in the trading. Okay, uh, my friend and I are interested in this makeup. This is correct uh -huh. by the answerer, the small box. Yeah. With the answerer, uh, okay, uh, ¿cómo se dice? Okay, uh, da entender, da entender que, que no está cerca, okay, que no es este algo que dirige, eh, que dirige, no que dice este, sino que dice como ese o, o aquel, no sé. Um, yeah, like I said, it could be possible uh, to use the word that as well. Yes. Okay, so this or that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that works. Just make sure that it's singular. That's the most important part. Okay. All right, let's see. Um, eh, who hasn't given me an answer? Let's see. Jennifer. Jennifer, you want to help me with number five? Number five, you can add for sweater to chart it does you can add those for for sweater to the charm okay but i can take two okay i okay you can't add the so those did you say those Okay, yes, very good. All right, so you can use the word those for sweaters to the chart. Um, if you think it's close by, if not, if you think it's, um, if you think that it's uh, um, close, uh, sorry, um, close to you, what would it be the answer? Jennifer? Mm, no. Uh, so you can use those or? Or that. Or that. Uh, no, sorry. No, that, no. That's a, um, no, this is our sweaters. So it's oh, sorry, these, 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 these or those. Right. These or those. Mm -hmm. Good. Excellent. All right. Um, okay. Let's see who I've I asked. Um, Warren. I have a no, question. Warner? Yeah. Uh -huh, go ahead. What does charts mean? chart um a chart is like um it, it has different meanings it, a chart can be like um like a kind of like a poster could be or it can also be like a file okay so basically okay. a chart has a meaning of either in spanish you can say um, cartel or it can be like a expediente Okay. okay. All right. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, let's have, um, let's see who hasn't helped me. I think Irene, Irene Azucena. You wanna help me with number six? Okay. I have to go to buy those new books at the library. I'm going with you. All right, very good, Inene, excellent. Absolutely, those. Why? Could you tell us why you chose? Because a uh, book is a plural, is mm -hmm. plural, right. and is um, so far to the library. Yeah. Exactly. This one is the only possibility, those, because just like Irene um, answered, 
the word books is plural, so it has to be, this has to be plural, and it's far away from you because notice is I'm going with you. So they are not at the library. The library is far away from them. Okay, sounds good? Yes. Okay, good. All right, guys. Okay, so, so far so good. Any questions, anything else that you wanna ask? No? Okay. And not me, not for the moment. All right, excellent. Okay, so let's put this into practice, okay? Um, I want you guys to be able to use this. So remember yesterday we talked about um, ordering things online. So what are we gonna do right now? Oops, just give me a moment while I erase this because otherwise you're gonna get confused. Let me erase this. Teacher, yeah. Oh, este, one, bueno, one question. O sea, para hacerlo más corto, existe la probabilidad dentro de la oración que si el objeto está cerca, tenemos que ocupar el 10, el 10 y si, el, si es singular, si el objeto está lejos, depende, existe esa probabilidad de ocupar el dat. O sea, igual lo mismo con los singulares con los plurales. You want to ask me in English? <laughs> Sorry, <teacher. laughs> it's okay. All right, try it. Go ahead. Uh, I, I I try. I, I will understand. Yeah, they, they, this is oh okay. I, I this are the chains to see the probability. Uh, the this is uh, the close uh, the close. Es, es, ¿Cómo se dice? Es, es, si está cerca o lejos, teacher, sorry. If it's <laughs> far away or close. The, the far away or close, yes, mm -hmm. teacher. Uh, eh, okay, so if it's close, it's close to you, there are two possibilities. This and these. Okay, the these. Um, so this, this singular. Singular. Yes. And okay, just to give you an example. Okay, so um, this marker, this marker, only one. Okay. And then we have these, these markers. So there are two, these. And then when it's far away from you, you say that that. And if it's far away and many, you're going to be using those. Okay. Does that make sense? Or do you, does that answer your question? I guess it. Yeah, are you sure? Yeah. Okay, so only possibility if it's far away, if it's far away and singular, that. And if it's far away and plural, you're gonna say those. Okay, the, that's the only possibility. All right. Okay, now what we're gonna do right now, uh, I guess it's here, it's um, now your turn, it says, Matt, um, we're, we're gonna be working in Paris. Imagine that you want to order a product online and have problems ordering it, okay? So you cannot, you want to order it, but you, don't, you can't do it online for whatever reason. So what you do is you call a representative from the company you want to order from so that he or she can help you to complete the uh, online order, okay? So you're going to call the, 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 rep, the representative and they're gonna help you to place the order. Describe the product you are seeing on the internet to the agent. So you can use that, those, okay? Because obviously if you're seeing the product on the internet, probably, um, you know, you are describing it so it's far away from you or whatever, if it's singular, plural. Also, the agent asks you about your credit card information. 
sorry, and billing information. Sorry, it should be and billing information. Okay. Um, to complete your order. So there, the, the agent is going to be asking for the information about your credit card number, the name on the on the card, the expiration date, right? So think think of all of those things that they could ask you. They could ask you about. Okay, let me let me write this down. So tell, let's 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 um, brainstorm. What information would you need from the credit card? What information? When you order something online, what 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 information do they need from the credit card? Mm, the number, number. The credit card. Yeah. Exactly, credit card. credit card number. Okay, what else? Well, the name on the credit card. The name on the credit card. Yeah. What else? The expired date. The expired date. Okay, what else? The security code. Security code, yeah. Secure, secure, security code. Good, all right. So you would ask this information, right? This information about it. All right, and also about the billing information. So for the billing information, you want to know the address, right? The billing address. Okay. All right, so you're going to be asking for that information. Okay. And then you're going to present your conversation in front of the class. All right. So is this clear for everybody? Do you understand what you're going to be doing? Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. Anything else? Any other questions that you have that you want to ask before I put you into your part with your partner? Okay. All right. I'm going to stop sharing. And before I put you into your groups, I'm going to take attendance. So let's see. Um, all right. Do I have Josue Salas? Yeah. Okay, good. Andres. Present. Giovanni. Present. Okay, Elsie. Elsie Jeanette. Present teacher. Okay, Manuel. Manuel Alejandro. Present teacher. Okay, good. Fabiola. Present. All right, good. Uh, from Juan Francisco. Present teacher. All right. Let's see, Edgar. Present teacher. Okay. All right. Do you have any problems with the camera, Edgar? Oh, okay. Okay. Good. Excellent. Uh, Marvin. Marvin. Present teacher. Oh, okay. Wonderful. There he is. Francisco Javier. Present. Wonderful. Julio Cesar. I hear teacher. All right. Alejandra. Here. Yeah. All right, there she is. Jennifer. No, Jennifer? Oh no, what happened to Jennifer? We lost her. Okay. All right. Uh, Manuel. Manuel. Present. Okay, very good. Thank you, Manuel. Werner. Present teacher. Wonderful. And Carla Cano. Carla, did we lose Carla? Did we lose Carla? Oh my goodness, we lost Carla. Okay, all right. Did I did every did I check everybody? Oh no, I, I didn't mention Irene. Irene Susana. Present. All right. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. Uh, 
Did I mention everybody else? ¿Hay alguien que no, no teacher. ha mencionado? Me, teacher. Oh, Zuleima, ok. Ok, all right, Zuleima. Wonderful. Everybody else I've mentioned, right? Okay, good. All right, so I'm going to right now divide you guys into groups. Uh, just give me a moment. Let's see. Um, okay, um, let me give you, I'm going to give you 10 minutes this time, and then we're going to be presenting in front of the class, okay? So remember, you're going to be presenting in front of the class, so make sure that you are ready and if you guys have any questions i'll be coming around to help you okay so here we go let's oh hold on. Mm -hmm. Vamos a hacer un, como un diálogo donde le ayuda a la gente para hacer una compra en línea, algo así. Pero no sé si. Do you understand what to do, guys? Teacher, we have to do a, a little. Yeah, how do you say diálogo? Dialogue, yes. Dialogue. A dialogue, yes. So. For example, Andres, you can be the the agent, and um, Fabiola can be the person that wants to buy the product. So Fabiola is having problems to make the order online, so she calls you, right? You are the representative from the company, and she calls you and says, "I want to order that um, that computer that you have on your website." Okay, and then she has to describe the product right to you. Okay, and then you are going to ask Fabiola for the information of the credit card so to process the online order. Okay, okay. yeah, okay. any questions? Not, I don't have questions. Okay, good. All right, okay. Uh, I'm going to go and help the other group. So, anything you need? Let me know if you if you have any questions, you can just ask for help. Okay. Do you do you know how to ask for help? Yes. Okay. I know. Okay. 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 All right. So best of luck. Five. 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 Four. Eight. Seven. Eight, seven, nine, oh, oh, sorry, zero, zero. Yeah, uh, yeah, oh, 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 zero, zero, mm, 45, okay, 40, five, seven, oh. five, seven, five. Sorry, Seven, four, four, nine, five, nine, 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 eight, eight, zero, eight, eight, zero. I, I, okay. I hope, Francisco, that this this is um a, a invented information. I hope it's not your real credit card. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, we're going to. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, it's not very... my real. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's it, it's better for me if he is it's a real candy crush number. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, no, no, no. The whole, and the, the whole in this case I, I, I need a security code number, please. But it's more important for me that it's number, okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's great. okay, okay. Uh, in this case, um, when I buy um, someone uh, some something in okay. internet, I think it's not a good idea uh, send that uh, give that information in call. Okay. Yeah, you got to be very careful because it's true. It's not, um, you know, it, it, yeah, not not everything is very secure. It's better to use. Uh, I think it's in uh, logging in Alibaba or some, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sure, you, yeah, you are yeah. right, okay? Yeah. But in this case, I need your second card because uh, <laughs> I okay. need to... <laughs> I'm going to go and help the other groups, guys. Okay. If you have any problems, you can just I need to fill okay. your information in the, in the form, okay? <laughs> 145. Okay. My sick. <laughs> okay. Mascara. The mask. Okay. Uh -huh, correct. Hi, entonces sería, uh, could you to give me uh, some information oh, guys, wait, about wait, the mask? Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, guys, I'm sorry to interrupt, but um, right now we're not doing this part, not just yet, okay? Right now what we're doing is we are practicing, uh, let, me, let me share with you again. Oh, um, do you mind if I, if I share? I'm going to stop sharing your your screen and I'm going to show right here what we're going to be doing. So I don't know if you guys can see this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So what we're doing here is we're just we are practicing ordering a product online. Okay, so don't worry, don't, don't do the could and can, not, not, not yet, not yet. Todavía no estamos ahí. Okay, so just what you're doing is you're ordering a product. You're gonna be describing the product. So describe the product you are seeing on the internet to the agent, okay? So you're gonna describe to the agent. To give you an example, let's imagine that Elsie, eh, Janet, you are the representative, okay, of the company. And Warner, you want to you want to create uh, sorry you yeah yeah buy the product. So you are going to ask Elsie to help you, and you're going to describe the product to Elsie. And then Elsie, you're going to be asking Warner the information for his credit card and for the billing information. Okay, that's it. Only that. All right. Okay. Sounds good. For for example, is. Uh, talking about this product mm -hmm. and Werner um, give me information of credit card. Right. You're, you, yeah, you're going to ask Werner uh, about his credit card information. Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Great. All right. Well, I'll stop sharing and if you guys need any help, just let me know. Just ask for, for help. Do you guys know how to ask for help here? ¿Saben cómo pedir ayuda si necesitan algo? Sí, teacher. Um, yes, teacher. And uh, llamarla usted de nuevo. Mm -hmm, exactly. Yeah. Okay. okay yes. Good. Yeah, just okay. let me know if something happens. I'm going to go in and help other people, okay? Okay. Thank teacher. you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Hi, Werner. Hi, Elsie. Edgar, what happened? Where's your partner? What, teacher? What happened to your partner? The, 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 the only work. No, yeah. No. No? Nunca tenido pareja. No, ahorita no. 
Pero qué raro, yo los... No sé con quién, pero... Qué raro. Bueno, yo he estado trabajando lo solo. Oh, my goodness, I'm so sorry, Edgar. I didn't no. know. When I made the groups, everybody had a partner. Everybody. <laughs> And then, so I don't know what happened. Maybe somebody... Um, Maybe they, they, they left and they didn't come back. Okay. Um, well, anyways, we're, it's almost time to go to, well, the, the baker, breakout room. So let me, let's just practice you and I. Let's practice, okay? Okay. Um, okay, let's see. Okay, so um, Edgar, you're going to be the buyer and I'm going to be the agent. So you're going to describe the product to me. Okay. Okay. Right. Uh, so I'm going to say, hello. Uh, uh, thank you for calling. Um, uh, um, water work department. How can I help you? Uh, hi, uh, good evening. Um, Jessica, uh, my, my name is Edgar Menjivar. Um, I'm interested in, in buying products online. Oh, wonderful. Uh, What product are you, are you interested in? Okay, and, and, I, and I have a purchase order with products for the office. Office. Uh, Which, uh, which are 10 desk, the manerial tires, 10 secretarial tires. Tire, you are interested in tires? Tires, yes. Okay, which tire are you interested in? Can you describe the tire to me? Sorry, teacher, repeat, please. Which tire are you interested in? Can you describe the tire to me? Yes, uh, the payment method is a by credit card, Visa Mastercard. Okay, that's wonderful. We will help you with the with um, the purchase. But could you please describe the tire for me? What does the tire look for like? What is the description of the tire? Ah, the, tire? Um, the description, mm -hmm. the, um, the, the desk as, um, um, I mean, <laughs> sorry, teacher. Okay. Sorry. What color, um, what color is uh, the tire? The color is, uh, and, and, Um, and black, black, black to black to white. Black and white. Black and black and okay. white. Oh, yeah. I see. It's this one. Is it the one that is a, the medium sized tire? Uh, the size is um, medium. Okay, wonderful. Can I have your credit card number? Uh, credit card number is uh, one, two, three, um, uh, four, six, five. Thank you. And can I have the name on the credit card? Uh, the, the name credit card. The name on the credit card. Uh, Visa Mastercard. It's a Mastercard. Okay, but what is the name that is on the credit card? Is the name Edgar Menjivar or Edgar Alve Alfredo Menjivar? What is uh, sorry, the name? Sorry, the, the name. Sorry, is <laughs> is it, um, pronunciation um, um, is a. Uh, Very, very hard. I understand. It's okay. Uh, 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 you're fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. You're doing good. You're doing okay. great. Okay. Yeah. All right. So what is the name on the card? 
Ah, the name uh, the card is Edgar Menkibar. Okay, Edgar Menkibar, wonderful. And what is the expiration date? Expiration date is um, um, March uh, 2023. March 20, March 2023, okay. 2000. 2023, yeah. 2023. Okay, and can I have the security code? Uh, security code is uh, um, 789. 789, okay. Thank you very much. Okay, um, Mr. Edgar Menjivar, we have placed the order for you. You will be receiving your tire in five business days. Yeah, do you know business days? Business day. Business day, ah. Business uh, days, días hábiles. Días hábiles. You will receive, uh, you will be receiving your tire in five business days. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for shopping with us. Have a good night. Okay. All right, bravo, excellent, <laughs> very, Thank very you. good. Thank you, teacher. Okay. You're welcome. Okay, then we're gonna go back to the main session and we're gonna meet the other people, okay? So okay. I'll see you over there. Okay, teacher, thanks. You're welcome. Uh, breakout rooms. Para volver nuevamente al... Al, al room. Dice... Hi guys. What happened? <laughs> Confundimos, teacher. Se quedaron acá. No. Okay. All right. We're gonna we're having everybody join us anyways. So we have, well, I think, everybody back. What we're going to do is uh, we're going to be um, having the conversations in front of the class. Okay. Um, remember to turn on your, your cameras. Okay. Make sure everybody has their camera on. Okay. Um, and we're going to be, well, first we're going to start with volunteers. Who would like to? Uh, volunteer to um, attend to the conversation. Volunteers? Not only, only, only one, one, not, not everybody at the same time, please. You lie. <laughs> you lie. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Edgar? No. Did you say something? Yes, teacher. Uh-huh. Hi. Oh, okay. You want to you want July, to you lie in me. Okay. All right. That sounds good. All right. Go ahead, uh, Marvin and Mrs. Okay, teacher. Uh good night. Can you help me? I'm having problems with the um, with my audio. That's okay. okay. Don't worry. We can hear you fine. I was I, I was just joking. I'm sorry. Okay, let's start from the from the beginning. Okay. Go ahead, can, I, can you help me? Sure. How can I help you, sir? I have problem ordering a pair on a sneaker the website. Okay, and what kind of uh, sneakers are you trying to buy? Uh, the sneaker I want a pair of Jordan Flu. All right, let me see if I can find them, and we can, I uh, that way I can help to make your order. 
I think I got your shoes, uh, Mr. Marvin. Are these the ones that you want? Yes, yes. <laughs> okay, let me mention to you that um, the price for these uh, sneakers is $424. Okay. Are you willing to pay it? Yes. Okay. So we are going to start with your information. First, I'm going to need your credit card number. Okay. The number of the credit card is 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. And what is the name on the credit card? Uh, 724. I'm sorry. Uh, I was asking you for the name on the credit card. The name. Oh, excuse me, Marvin Gonzalez. Okay, thank you so much. What about the expiration date? Do you have that number? 724. Thank you. Uh, can you also provide me the security code? Security code is... That will be the, the uh, three digit number on the back of your car. Ah, okay. Is 123. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, do you have a billing address? Yes. Uh, Colonia Ibu, sector 2000, house number 10. All right, thank you so much. Uh, just before we process the payment, let me mention to you that it's going to have a six, uh, $76 for handling or shipping costs. Are you okay. willing to pay it too? Yes. All right. So the total amount that we are going to withdraw from your credit card will be $500. Are you we agree with that? Yes. All right. The payment has been processed and you should be receiving your product in the next uh, three to five <laughs> working days. Okay. All right. Okay, that's it for our participation, teacher. Bravo, very good. Okay, let me let me give you guys. Very good, excellent. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Let me just um. Give you one of those two. <laughs> okay. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you so okay. much. Yeah. Very good, guys. All right. Um. Very professional. Excellent. Okay. Yes, yes. All right. Who's next? Who wants to go next? Oh, okay. All right. Wonderful. Um, let's. Who would like to be the second group? Okay. All right. Let's have. Um, okay. Let's have Julio Cesar. Can you give me a number? Um, a number from one to 16. One to 16, mm -hmm. okay. Uh, number nine. Number nine, okay. Let me see who's gonna be number nine. Give me a moment, I'm gonna tell you in a moment. Warner. Are you with us, Werner? Yo no soy el número 10, teacher. Creo que soy el 18. Sorry? I didn't hear you. I never, uh, no lo terminamos, teacher. Oh, okay. I, I, it's okay. Uh, Whatever you have. No worries. No worries. Um, uh, can, can you turn on the, the, the camera, Werner? Just to yes. Just I need a permission. I'm working right now. I came back in five minutes. Oh, okay, okay. We'll we'll be we'll wait for you. Okay, so Warner, who are you working with? Oh, I work in uh, L. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Oh, All right, so we'll listen to both of you. Go ahead. Um, 
tú com eh, Elsie, you, Hola. tú comienzas. No, porque el, el problema lo tienes tú. Ah, es mío, ok, ok. Uh, can you help me? I have the problem with the foil. I bad was, what is the matter? What is the matter? Uh, I need to review your... Uh... No, 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 no. no. Pero, pero yo creo que... No, 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 no. Espera, moment, moment, teacher. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's okay. Don't worry. Take your time. Eh, o si quieres, empiezo yo. Uh, ok. Comienzas tú, Elsie. Ok. Thank you for calling. Uh, Elsie is speaking. How can I help you? Uh, hi, Elsie. Uh, can you help me? I have the problem with the foil. About uh, what is the matter? What is the problem with your product? Uh, I haven't. I haven't no received. I need to verify the information on your credit card. On your, on your information, uh, yes, credit card. Your credit card number is? Uh, one, three, four, five. What is his name? Uh, my, his name is uh, Reyes. Uh, his name. I'm oh, sorry, Werner. 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 The last name. The last name, Reyes. Give me the expiration date. Uh, expiration date and uh, December uh, 2025. And security call, please. Security call, please, is uh, 9530. And finally, your billing address. Uh, uh, I see no sé, teacher. <laughs> la dirección. La dirección de facturación. De, de, Ajá. De facturación. Uh -huh. yes, um, ok, San Salvador, uh, Colonia La Rábida, uh, décima avenida norte, de, no, de Street. Ten uh, Avenue, um, number Nike. Only that teacher. <laughs> the teacher. Hi, excellent, bravo, very, very good. Very good, let me give um, the applause, excellent, and very good. Let's uh, get one of these as well. Excellent. All right, guys, very good. Okay. All right. Um, I just wanted, um, I just noticed some things, um, just uh, just something to be careful about. Is he said, um, I haven't no receipt. Is that correct, Warner? The, you said something about that, I haven't no receipt? Yes, teacher, no receipt. Okay, so just be careful with that. Remember, it's not I haven't. The negative of have is not haven't. The negative is don't, do not have or don't have. Okay, so just be careful about that. Okay, so just remember that. And also remember you're asking, if you're asking the person is, you say, what is your name? What is, um, your number, et cetera, et cetera. Don't say his or her because you're talking directly to the person. So it'd be your. That's good, excellent. Very, very good. Okay. Uh, Warner, do you, do you live do you live in Colonia La Rabida? Yes, teacher. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. We are very close. I you, I I we are very close to um, we we live um, very close by. 
Uh, good. You, uh, yeah. you live, teacher? Where? I, Where? I live. Um, I live by the park, by the park Montpellon. Ah, Montpellon. Ah, it's very, yeah. it's, it's, it's yeah. very close. Yes, teacher. Very, very close. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Interesting. A small world. <laughs> yes, teacher. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Excellent. Okay. What we're gonna do right now? Um, we're going to. We're actually. Because of time, we're not going to have everybody um, say their their the conversation. Maybe we'll have um, in the, like maybe later on we'll have everybody practice the conversation. But the first thing what we're going to do is we're going to I'm going to show you. We're going to go back again to the PowerPoint. Give me a moment. Tell me when you can see my PowerPoint. Okay. Can you see the PowerPoint? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. So we have here a conversation. This conversation is um, also, this is a very, a, some conversation very similar to what you did. Um, but here we're talking about, um, we're asking information about the product. Okay, not about um, the credit card information, but about the product. So um, let's let's have um, right right now. What I want you to do is you're going to open up your book. This is um, page twenty one, and I want you to practice this conversation with the partner. But before we practice the conversation, um, I I want uh, two people to help me practice this in front of the. Uh, Front of the class. So, who would like to be Linda? Anybody would like to read Linda? Me. Me, teacher. Okay. Who said me? Or she? Okay. So, um, um, we'll have Francisco be Juan. And who wants to be Linda? Elsie? Okay. okay. All right. Go ahead, Elsie. You'll be Linda. Thanks so much for calling. Linda is speaking. How can I help you? Hi, Linda. Could you give me some information about the Pro Watcher? Of course. It has a capacity of 5.2 CU point FT point, a turbo processor, and an intelligent cable. I see. Can you give me information about the warranty? I'm sorry. Could you repeat that, please? Can you give me information about the warranty? Thanks. The warranty of it is for two years old. Thank you. All right. Bravo. Excellent, guys. All right. Okay, so any questions about the vocabulary here? Yes, teacher. Uh huh. Uh, what is the meaning? Oh, oh, what? No. What is the pronunciation? The C U point F T. This. Point. Uh huh. This right here. Um, yes. If I'm not mistaken, it's a uh, cubic feet. Cube. Repeat, please. Cubic feet, I think it is. Cubic, cubic. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. Anything else? Any other vocabulary that you don't understand, or or the pronunciation of something? Okay. Remember that this the, the word here is keyboard. Okay, keyboard. All right, so what I'm going to do quickly, I'm going to give you guys a chance there to practice this conversation with a partner. It's on page uh, 21. So right now I'm going to quickly make the groups and just practice the conversation and then switch. Uh, so one time you're going to be Linda and the next time you're going to be Juan. Okay, so um, let me make the groups right now. Give me a second. And 
I'm just gonna, I'm going to quickly um, do this. So we're gonna give you only three minutes to do it, okay? Or I think, well, four minutes, okay? All right, here we go. Let's open the rooms. Juan Francisco, any questions? You having problems joining? Juan Francisco, are you having trouble joining? Five point two Q. Do you have any questions, girls? Um, uh, you said, what is the the pronunciation? What's the convert? What's the pronunciation of what? Cubic feet. Um, she means cubic feet. Cubic feet, yeah. Cubic feet. And what is for the correct pronunciation for capacity? Capacity. 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 Yes. Capacity. Mm -hmm. Okay. Any others? Capacity. 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 Well, that's all. That's it. Uh, I see. Can you give me information about the warranty? I'm sorry. Could you repeat that, please? Oh, okay. Can you give me information about the warranty? Okay. The warranty of this book. You. Two years, three years, five years. Okay, and we go. Thank you so much for calling. Linda is speaking. How can I help you? Okay. Hi, Linda. Can you give me some information about the? We have a question. Uh, Q fifth is como cubo pies cubicos. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's 5.2 qubit, a turbo processor, cubic and an intelligent cubic. keyboard. Cubic, cubic feet. Cubic, cubic. Uh, cubic. cubic feet. Cubic feet. Cubic feet. Cubic feet, a turbo processor, and an intelligent keyboard. I see. Can you give me information about the warranty? I'm sorry. Could you repeat that, please? Can you give me information about the warranty? Thanks. The warranty office for four years. OK, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, me, Linda. OK. And I want <laughs> okay.
Okay, wonderful, everybody. So um, almost everybody's here. Okay, excellent. All right. Now, if you noticed in the conversation, they were asking about um, questions. They were asking the the um, customer questions, and the questions were very polite. They were respectful, and the reason why they're polite and respectful is because we're talking about one, a stranger. Un, es un extraño, ¿verdad? So when you are talking to a stranger, you're going to be um, you're you're going to be very polite because you don't know the person, right? So somebody that you don't know very well, you're going to be very polite. Also, because it's a formal context, the person is calling from a company, so it's very formal. So when you when you are being formal, you have to be very polite. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to share the whiteboard here and I want you guys to tell me if you guys can see this or not tell me tell me when you can see it one point yeah can you see it I, I know. It. Okay, hold on. I'll start. No, no. Yes. Yeah, can I see? Okay. Yeah, I no, can you see it. Okay. It's just that sometimes the uh, students say, no, I can't see it because it's all white, but it's because it's a whiteboard. <laughs> okay. So um, let's start. Let's talk about using can and could. Okay. Now, you know that can, basically, with can, um, we can use can and could for, a, for for talking about abilities, right? Okay, so um, this is one possibility of using abilities. Okay, so um, Okay, so we can use can and could for abilities, both, both present and past. Okay, so we can talk to give you an example. We can say, I can uh, dance flamenco. Okay. So that is something that we're talking about abilities. I have the ability to dance flamenco. I can also talk about the past and I can say, um, I could speak um, French when I was a child. But now I can't speak French, right? So I've lost that ability of speaking French. Okay, so we can use this. We can use this to talk about abilities, right? Um, when we can use can to talk about an ability. Oops, moment. Can to talk about ability of. Um, the present, I can dance flamingo now, okay? Or I could talk about the past. I could speak French in the past, but when I was a child, but now I can't speak it. I'm an adult, I can't speak it anymore, okay? So we can use this for both present and past. Is this clear for everybody? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So far so good, everybody's clear about this? And notice that with um, can and could, uh, because they're model auxiliaries, both can and could, after the verb is gonna be in the base form. So we're not gonna change anything. So even if I were to change this, so imagine I, I didn't say, imagine it wasn't, um, I can dance, sorry, imagine if it was he, he could speak French when he was a child when he was a child. So even if we change the subject, it's still going to be, um, it's still gonna be speak, okay? 
We're still going to be using speak because after the after the the um, the model auxiliary, we always use the base form the verb. So it's not going to be he could speaks. No, it's going to be he could speak. So this is going to be in the original form. So far, so good. Is that clear? Yeah, it's clear. Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Now another reason why we use another reason why we use can and could is for permission. So there's there are many reasons, and I'm just going over all of these, right? So permissions. Permission. Okay. And I can say, for example, uh, she she could uh, wear, I'm sorry, so they say she can wear jeans to work. Okay, so it means she has the permission of wearing jeans to work. Or we can talk about the past. Okay, and we can say, for example, uh, you can, um, you or you can't, sorry, he, you, you could, and we're talking about the past, you could um, uh, use the um, the company or at any time. So it means that you had the permission of using the company car. And once again, we are going to be okay. we're going to be using um, the can. Let me change the color. We're going to be using can to talk about permission of the present and could to talk about permission of the past. Okay. And once again, we're going to be using the base form of the verb. In this case, we're going to be using where, even though the subject she. So you're not going to say she can wear. You're going to say she can she can wear. And the same thing you could use, not you could use or or using or used. It's always going to be in the base form of the verb. Okay. So this is once again, like I was explaining. This is for present and pass, okay, right. So this is probably the way that you are used to using it. However, today we've also, we I also wanna show you that another way that you can use it is when we want to be polite. So polite requests, okay, polite requests. Okay, requests are like solicitudes or, um, Let's say this is like there's some stories. And in this case, it's not about the present and the past. They are exactly the same. So I could say, for example, um, can you please can you give me your name, please? Okay. That's just a, a, a very a very formal and polite way of asking. Okay. Could you provide me with your credit card number? Okay. Can can he um, can he write a um, a medical note for me or could could um could they help me with this please okay so if you notice in each one of these i use the word can okay i'm using can and, or could, and here it does. It's not really about 
um, being about the present or the past. This is actually a, a polite request in the present, independent, if it's, um, if it's using can or could. Okay, so can or could. Okay, it's all going to be the same. And which one are you going to use? Pretty much, it doesn't matter. They both mean the same thing. Maybe the only difference that I would say that exists between um, between can and could is that could is a little bit more formal. Okay, it's a little bit more formal, but it's the same. Like this, you can. They're both used for polite requests, right? Okay, or solicitudes. So you're always going to be using the base form of the verb, like give, provide right, help, okay? We're always gonna be using that. And make sure that because it's a polite request, we're gonna be using always the, the question mark, right? So don't forget the question mark because it's a polite request. Okay. We can use please to make it even more polite. Like, can you give me your name, please? Could you help us with this, please? So that's just adding more politeness. And because it's a question, make sure that you're going to be using the, um, the subject. In this case, we're using you. You can be singular. Like, can you give me your name? So it's talking about your one person. Me puedes dar tu nombre, right? Or it could be plural, right? Like. Could you provide me with your credit card number? Me podrían proveer con sus números de la tarjeta de crédito. Okay, so it's plural. That could be also plural. Or we can make it like he, or in this case, they. Okay. Any questions so far? No, no, no questions. It's all clear? Yes? Okay, so no, no problems. Everything is clear about how to use can and could. Yeah? Okay, all right. I'm gonna take this silence as a yes, but it's okay. So what I'm gonna ask you to do is, um, I want you to think about um, something that you could ask your classmates. Um, about, a um, a, about a product that they sell at the request that you put that that you want to make your classmates. And I want you to create questions in exercise number. Number five on page 20, 22, page 22, you're going to be doing that for homework, okay? So I want you to think about questions that you can ask your classmates, um, polite questions that you can ask your classmates using can or could. All right, sounds good? Yes. Yeah? All right, perfect. All right. Okay, guys, so that's going to be all for today. Um, and I'm just going to ask uh, Carla. Carla, uh, Carla Lopez is on here? No? Okay. Okay, no problem. Anyways, um, so that will be all. If any anybody, since Carla is not here, does anybody want to take her place and um, stay behind? We can do that. No? Okay. Okay, no problem. O sea, nadie, nadie necesita quedarse para pueden tomar el, ahí el lugar de Carla ya que no está ahorita. No? Okay. All right, guys. In that case, um, it's great to see you again. Um, and if there are no questions, that will be all for today. Okay? I hope everybody is, uh, is great and have a wonderful night. Thank you so much. Thanks, teacher. Thank Good night, everybody. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good, Good night. Guys. See Good you night. tomorrow. See you tomorrow.
Thank you, teacher. And you have a good night too. Thank you. You too. Have a wonderful night. Thank you. Hello, Suleyma. Hello. Good night, teacher. Good night, Suleyma. Take care. Thank you. You're welcome. I like your background, by the way. <laughs> <laughs>